Hi there, Jerry Chen here. In this video, I want to show you a very powerful and interesting desktop sharing tool called Makogo. And uh, it's located at www.makogo.com. Makogo.com. So it's automatically forwarded to slash welcome.aspx. But anyhow, uh, this tool was recently introduced to me by my friend Malika Duke, and I found it to be very lightweight and powerful, in at least in its feature set. So uh, anyhow, long story short, I went ahead and downloaded the software installed on my computer, and uh, I used it to run a uh, webinar with a couple of friends on the, uh, through the internet today, and we all like um, what Makogo has to offer. So uh, I just wanted to bring this to your attention. Um, if you're not familiar with how a webinar works, uh, there should be uh, plenty of resources on Google that will show you or explain to you what a webinar is. And if you do know, um, I'm not going to go into too much detail here. All you need to know is that a webinar tool allows you to see exactly what's happening on the other person or the host's uh, computer screen. Okay, so um, Makogo is a free tool as they state on the top of the page and the first thing you need to do is click on this yellow button here in the middle of the page that says download, click here, save the file and make sure you know the um, location where the file is saved you want to double click on the executable file once the saving is completed and uh, install that software and once it's installed um, what you want to do is watch the two tutorial videos here there's one video on how to start Makoga meeting and there's a second video on how to participate in a Makoga meeting and currently I have a Makogo meeting running in the background so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, fire it up let's see window should come up in a minute so my uh, Makogo window is going to pop up right there and uh, so what you're seeing on the screen right now is actually a remote computer it's my uh, little laptop so let me do this so you can see what's happening there And let me type in uh, automate. This is my website there. So you can see um, this is a great uh, webinar tool. And uh, like all webinar tools, you can actually uh, switch back and forth between presenters and also allow uh, your guests to. Uh, remote control your host computer so they can show you what they want to communicate with you directly on your computer screen and uh, what I found to be fairly interesting with Makogo is actually um, its ability to uh, switch back and forth between uh, rem uh, between a presenter and host fairly quickly it's actually one of the fastest I've ever seen with um, um, with all the different um, webinar tools I've used in the past. So anyhow, um, I'm not going to go into too much detail in terms of how to set up the file and start the meeting or um, some of the more advanced uh, features. Uh, let me just do something real quick here. Just demonstrate one more thing before I go into the comparison. Uh, this is the whiteboard tool. I'm going to go ahead and click on the highlighter. Let me pick blue so I can show you um, as an example if we're commentating on this lead generation page here um, we can use the highlighter to you know underline or circle different areas on the page to better communicate graphically with um, the participants on um, on the call or on the webinar okay so I'm gonna move this out of the way and uh, go into the comparison here um, some of you guys might be interested in finding out the cost of Makogo and um, in the beginning of the video I have already said it's free 
Um, I don't know how much longer it's going to remain free, but for right now, uh, it's it's free, and I'm not complaining. It's a great tool. Uh, just remember that there is a limit uh, of 10 participants uh, right here. You can show anything you want in true color quality to up to 10 people at the same time. So if you have more than 10 participants or 10 different computers logging into the same meeting, it's not gonna work and you'll have to look for other options and I happen to know a couple that are pretty um, pretty uh, widely used and highly respected so I am going to uh, just do a simple comparison here um, the first uh, service that I want to uh, int uh, first other service I want to introduce to you is called Zoho Meeting. I've been using Zoho Meeting for a couple of years now and um, it's been great so far. Um, it is not a free service if you want to have more than one participant. One-on-one -on -one, um, webinar or desktop sharing is still free but um, as the number of participants you desire to have on your webinar increases, um, so does the cost. Okay. Now Zoho is very affordable. You can see that if you want to have five partici participants, it's twelve dollars. If you want to have ten, it's eighteen. If you want to have twenty-five, it's twenty-four dollars. If you want to have more than twenty-four, um, you obviously have to use a different service, and um, that's where GoToWebinar comes in. Um, but again, you can tell that the price range or the price point of GoToWebinar is quite a bit more than Zoho um, for good reasons. Um, you can have up to a thousand attendees. So that's quite an upgrade from a Zoho meeting in Makogo. As well, you get um, free uh, conference call numbers and also free voice over IP which means your uh, voice can be transmitted directly through the internet without uh, actual call-in number um, so your webinar participants will be able to listen to the presentation as well as seeing the real-time uh, desktop sharing uh, from the host computer without having to dial another phone number all they need is to turn on their uh, computer speakers or put on their computer headsets okay so uh, I guess it depends on what your needs are but Makogo remains a very uh, feasible option for general desktop sharing and webinar use as long as you have less than 10 participants uh, it's extremely fast and extremely powerful um, but weigh your options before you make an investment all right i hope this video has been helpful to you and uh, uh hope your business uh grows like crazy in 2009 i know it's a down economy but i think it's a great time for entrepreneurs like you and i so signing off and uh, look forward to seeing you in the next video